Monday. Motivation. What is up, Mr. Craig? I feel pumped this week. You're pumped. I, you got some sleep this weekend, didn't you? I got some. I got some. I got some. Some. <laughs> what? <laughs> it cut out. <laughs> I oh. said I got honey in these pots, Mr. Craig. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Buckle up, it's the Insurance Dudes Podcast. So, <laughs> we we went on this other podcast last week. And I've been thinking about it a lot. And yes. over the weekend, I grabbed the guy who we were on the podcast with, David Carruthers. Yes. He's a mastermind at commercial insurance, a hustler, a guy that gets it done and does not policies in the in the thousands, but policies in the tens and hundreds of thousands, like yes. big, big, big premium policies. Um, yes. And he has some, some methodologies of getting, of attracting and acquiring those clients, but really importantly, and what we're going to get into on Wednesday, which is a no miss Wednesday is some automation he created and a system to get this new business. And I thought it was, what? yeah. Yes. What if you could get paid to get leads instead of paying for leads that you could get paid to get leads? What if that was a possibility? Well, yeah. you will find out it's more than a possibility and David's doing it. We learned this on his podcast, Power Producers, which is an awesome podcast. Um, mm -hmm. And we're like, dude, you got to come on the show and we got to talk about this. Yeah. And he said, sure. You know, all of this kind of came together. I saw this quote over the weekend from Mark Cuban. Have you heard of him? Um, yes. The okay. sandwich guy, right? He made yes. this. Like, what? <laughs> he made the, the Cuban, Cuban sandwich? sandwich. <laughs> uh, no, he made the cigar. So oh. uh, this is what he said. Autom it's very simple. Automation is going to cause unemployment and we need to prepare for it. I don't think there's an industry that's more unprepared for, or at least a, a, a facet of the agency of the, uh, age of the industry than yep. the agency force in being lackadaisical about a lot of these types of technologies that are out there, this insure tech world, right? I mean, there's a whole niche of our yeah. industry called insure tech. Right? And it's not going to take away from the agent. It's going to amplify the agent, right? We've talked about this in the past. It amplifies. Like if somebody's getting those automated messages on their birthday and and all these different events that's happening in their life. And they're, they're constantly being served the way they want to be served, but also it gives you more time to just talk to them. Right. Yeah. So it amplifies everything that's old school and legit that you love about insurance. Yeah. So it's not, it's, it's like, you know, I wouldn't want to fight, uh, you know, what was the robo did from the, from the eighties? What was the movie? The with the, the Transformers. No. Robo Robocop. Robocop. I wouldn't want to fight Robocop, right? Because he has yeah. some technology. But it's like that's the deal. It's like we or can predator. use all these tools. They're tools. And they're better yeah. tools than we used to have. Just use the tools no. to amplify what yeah. you're good at. You nailed it because because we can all agree it'd be it's awesome to send out um, or to call everybody on their birthday, right? Yes. In your book. So if you have 100%. a, a, a Matheson book or even, you know what, if you yeah. have a normal book, three million, right, three, three million in premium. So you have a couple thousand clients or a thousand clients, whatever that is, and you want to talk to each of them. I mean, even if it was just three calls a day, it's going to become a struggle, right, doing that. Yeah, you're going to feel to do it every single day when you could flip a switch, push a button and have that thing automated. I mean... It's, and then now that hour, two hours, you just picked it up. Well, what if there's so many different tasks that are able to be automated, right? That you could, that you could change and do that. Um, I mean, it changes the game. And the guy down on the street or the gal down the street, they are going to do it. So right. this is how people are going to get left behind going into 2021, 2022. And heck, you're going to be staying home till tw the end of 2021 anyway. So what the heck? And so if you're Work. lost this week and you, you, you're just like, I don't even know where to start with all this stuff, 
do one thing, look at email automation, look at, look at, just look at some automation stuff, not from the standpoint of, oh, this stuff is crazy and sucks, but look at it from, just learn a little bit about it. If you learn a little bit about it every week, eventually it's not going to be a shocker and, and you're going to implement some of these things because a, a lot of them really aren't that hard. Right? No. Right? But, There's well, little with, things that you that aren't that hard. Yeah. Yeah. And with the, um, I mean, with Fiverr or Freelancer or all these places where you can hire somebody for four bucks an hour. I mean, there's no excuse not to have somebody do some of the stuff for you. Right. I mean, it's right. So, so if that isn't the most juicy preset for a uh, episode that's coming up, David Carruthers from the power, the power producer. Talk. I mean, it is going to yes. be something. Yeah, that was fun going on there. We got to talk a little bit about popcorn. Yes, microwave. That was hilarious, popcorn. and the yeah. fumes that consumes us. <laughs> Maybe that should be the name of the episode: "The Fumes That Consumes." <laughs> I love it. So, going into this week, think. And you know, grab a book, grab a grab, a, type in automation on YouTube, and and find something. YouTube. We're gonna be, that'll be the motif of the week, um, as we you know we're gonna cut some pieces from the interview that we take that we do on Wednesday. It's gonna be great. So enjoy, have a good week. Let's do it. Cool, be talk. Motivation Monday. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Motivation <laughs> Monday. <laughs> Hey, you've got to check out the Insurance Dude's Inner Circle coming soon where you get extended interviews as well as live coffee talks in our private Facebook group. Join the mailing list today at theinsurancedudespodcast.com. Hey, thanks for checking out the Insurance Dudes. Hey, please subscribe. We got some really great stuff coming out.